Republican strategist Rick Tyler, he nails it. Listen to what he had to say about his court in Congress. Rick, what do you make of the way that Kevin McCarthy is handling this? I think Kevin McCarthy decide, has to decide whether he's going to be in charge, and he should have uh, made very clear to the to the conference that he is in charge. Uh, and instead of appeasing a handful of people, I, I mean, think about this: a handful of people uh, can keep the government from funding our our military, our uh, Pentagon defense. Uh, bill, which keeps all Americans safe. And they're going to shut that down. Uh, McCarthy is dealing with people, and I think Lawler had it right, although I think he was nice calling it a clown show. McCarthy is dealing with people that are, frankly, not smart enough to be in Congress. Well, sorry, let me take that back. They're too stupid to be in Congress. They don't understand the process. They don't understand the procedure. They don't understand what's at place. And when this is maniacally simple, if I'm for getting government under control and having less spending. But when you don't have the votes, and politically, you have to go out in an election and get more people who are willing to vote your way and get the American people to see things your way. Instead, they're going to shut down the government. And what that says to every American is Republicans do not, who are in charge, do not know how to govern. And going into an election with a shutdown where you don't know how to govern is a losing message. I can't think of a, a single shutdown that's ever happened uh, in modern history that has benefited the Republicans, where we came out of the shutdown uh, better off than we were uh, before. So McCarthy better get control of this. He better figure out all the levers that he has uh, to make sure that we do not uh, have a shutdown. Uh, but right now, if you can't pass a defense authorization bill, what can you pass? And if there is any doubt what other Republicans think about the current crop of Republicans that are populating the House and many other MAGA areas, it, one could not say it any better. The, the fact that we have our country in, in the hands of people like this doesn't speak poorly as, as poorly for those who are in, the, in Congress as it does for what has happened to those who elected them. We have a lot of work to do to start educating folks because the machine that has indoctrinated the minds of many, sadly, that is to blame for having a Congress that simply can't perform. And you know who loves it? The wealthy. You know who loves it? The oligarchy. Because out of chaos, they can take it all. And guess what? That's what they're doing. We spend a lot of time deconstructing the news, trying to trying to parse it into a form that everybody can understand. We try to find those little nitpicks where uh, it goes, it flies above the fray, etc. If you really like these videos that we do, I want to ask a big favor. Please go ahead, number one, subscribe to our channel, and number two, please join if you can. Thank you so kindly for watching. Keep watching. Please remember to share. We must populate the entire internet with our progressive message, a message that we know is what most Americans say that they want. So help us please join.